Hello, this is Tim Sullivan once again for Flux TV and today we'll be talking about the Flux F425 special purpose liquid saver pump. So to uh, put that in perspective, uh, let's start with just a normal pump and what happens when you immerse this into the drum and you uh, say start pumping liquid. Um, we know the drum is empty when there's no more liquid coming out. We normally will tilt the drum and angle this down, but eventually there's no more liquid coming out of the, uh, the pump and we presume the drum is empty. But what has occurred is the last bit of liquid that went into this tube, you're asking air to push it up and out to discharge, which it will not do. So when the motor is shut off, product drains back, much like taking your finger off a straw. So there's about a half a gallon a minimum that will drain back. So we have a solution, that's the, uh, the F425 liquid saver pump. And um, the reason this exists is because uh, that residual product, uh, it can be expensive or it can be considered a hazardous waste. So what makes this, um, this design unique is it has a built-in foot valve. And you can see uh, here that uh, the valve is in the up position. And the way this works is you, uh, you pump the product and uh, when there's no more product coming out, you rotate these levers to a 180 degree angle, so from 90 to 180. And in doing so, you drop the, uh, the foot valve into the down position. It's uh, almost the same as if you put your hand over the bottom of the tube. So when the motor shut off, no product uh, escapes, and you uh, have an empty drum, 99.98% and the product in the tube can be put into the next drum or, or emptied uh, in a, uh, say, a Home Depot bucket. Another big advantage of this design is that it has top pullout. So all pumps need to be cleaned or uh, at times uh, repaired and everything comes out, impeller and all. So you have an empty tube and then you have this, uh, the inner tube assembly with the impeller. So it's easy to work on and then it all goes back together. I also want to point out that this comes in a couple different materials. This is 316 stainless steel. We also have uh, polypropylene. And both uh, materials come in three different lengths. We have a 27 inch, we have a 39 inch for 55 gallon drum, and then we have a 47 inch which is ideal for say a 275 gallon uh, tote or uh, IBC. A couple other things is uh, the pumps are furnished with a hose connection. I'm showing you a poly one, but uh, be a stainless steel uh, one inch on this pump. You can also do uh, one inch NPT male threads. You can put a tri-clamp fitting on it, or we can actually uh, furnish the pump with a welded on uh, tri-clamp. So many options, in, uh, including uh, ANSI flanges. So that, uh, that kind of covers the, um, the F425 liquid saver, special purpose pump, and I uh, hope you find some applications for it. And I thank you for your time today. Tim Sullivan, Flux TV. Thank you.